Hello and good afternoon and welcome back to Civ 5 and the CMEs and the CMEs or the Siamese? Oh my god, words, words today. But we are doing alright, we're not doing too badly at all. If you remember we've got our three city set up on the north of this sort of eastern island that pretty much just contains Germany now doing whatever it is that Germany does. I think expand is probably the, uh, the best way of putting it but they're doing alright at the moment can't complain about them we are attempting to keep germany from attacking us so we've got a pretty good um anti-aircraft uh army we've got gunboats systematically deployed around various um city states around the map you can see another few here giving us influence per turn we've only got one turn until the next uh world conference as well which is good now all of these announcements are pretty much just the fact that people are making peace and now i'm friends with them um and somebody i think stole railroads from us which is you know annoying but not the worst uh ask for a tribute yeah there we go malika is now under my charms shall we put them as well um okay fair enough right I'm not getting involved in a fight with William. Now we've got the, uh, the Congress coming up uh, next turn. Fingers crossed. Oh god, Bismarck has completed the Manhattan Project now. Oh god, that's always wonderful. And I have a feeling that Germany will probably have uh, a few more texts than I do in terms of actually creating missiles. But I'm just looking. And you know what? I might be just insanely lucky. I don't think Germany's got any nuclear material. No, I think I think we may be really, really lucky on that one. Wow. If we've got away with that, I don't know how. But there we go. Um, so, yeah. So for now, um, let us just... Here we go. Rocket artillery has just been given to us. That's nice as a troop, isn't it? We don't mind that at all. Rocket artillery are our favourite sort of artillery after all. Um, let's just save up our income just for a turn or two. Just where... Okay, just more interception. Thank you very much. Uh, historical landmarks and the international games. Now, we don't really want the international games to go through, um, namely because people will get influence with city-states and we don't want to give them that, and we don't have much production. Um, and also tourism. Tourism's a big thing. Let's just have a look and see here what that's likely to do. So you can see here, ridiculously, we are, we are familiar with a few um, different civs here. And we are giving dissidents as well to Germany, which is quite fun. Um, civil resistance to Portugal again quite fun but apart from that it's all fairly standard oh let me just check here so the Shejani again have good culture sorry tourism as do Germany let's just see how they're doing Shejani uh, no they're doing pretty bad to be honest and then Germany I imagine won't be doing much better no not really never mind um, okay fair enough so I mean, if it goes through, it goes through. Historical landmarks would be good because it would give me more culture for all my landmarks and it would... Yeah, no, that would be very good. Yay one, nay one. Lots of people are going to go yay on that, so I'm going to have to vote with all my might against it, I think. Maybe just put two towards historical landmarks. I don't want the international games to go through at all. That would be disastrous for me because I just won't have the production to keep up with the likes of Germany with, with all of its cities. Um, I just, I wouldn't be able to do it. Um, enemy denunciation of me has expired. Oh, that's nice. That makes me feel a little better. Um, okay. Let's have a quick look here. International Games seems like it's failed. I think they both failed, actually. Let's just do production quickly. Military base here. No, we don't need one. Well, we've, we've got as much defence as we can get here, actually. So, um, you know, I might actually start having to build more troops here. Uh, let's just get some submarines being built here, I think, actually. What we lose in gold per turn, we make up with uh, influence for city-states around the world. So, historical landmarks wasn't passed either. We would have had to put, what? nine or ten votes towards it we couldn't have guaranteed it actually we could have done international games wasn't going to get passed anyway really oh wow if we'd gone 10 10 that would have worked oh well oh well uh what else can we do we could go for a world of religion but again it's not going to do much for me i've got 20 votes 
20 votes is quite good. I can get through anything I need to. Um, until then, what should I do? I really, again, I wanted cult, uh, nuclear non-proliferation to go through. That would have been really good. That would have stopped Germany from stockpiling nuclear warheads, which they are likely to do. Until then, I'm going to do, yeah, historical landmarks again. Let's just put that through. Let's see if we can get it through second time. Second time lucky. Uh, I've got some submarines in the queue. Wonderful. Lemon City is doing the Apollo program. That's wonderful. Thank you very much for that. After that, yeah, to be honest, I think some more submarines just to, to keep my influence nice and tight. Awesome. Now let's just check how we're doing in the demographics. We haven't looked in a little bit. You can see soldiers, Germany, we're actually beginning to catch up with them very slowly. Um, it's very unlikely that we're going to beat them in soldiers. Germany just have far more production than we do. But we should be all right, to be honest. Um, there we go, cargo ship. Uh, Geneva, yeah, let's just keep the trades going. Geneva, you can see here as well, Malika, we're actually getting more influence with them. We're coming down on Portugal pretty quickly. They're the only, only city-state now that is uh, not, uh, you know, allied with us. Let's just check a random one like Sofia. Now you can see here that we have got quite a lot of military power of them. So yeah, they're likely to become quite influenced by us quite quickly. If we keep building up the military, I reckon we'll be able to influence every single city-state just without actually putting any troops near them at all. I don't know if that's true. I don't know if it works like that. But it's worth a try just to keep Germany off our backs, to be honest. Um, yeah. You see, we need more. We need more people trading with us, really. That would have been good. Again, another fighter. We'll just intercept the U. Thank you. There you go, that. Who is this guy? This is a great person. Wow, look at that. This is the, is it the Mongolian one or the, the, the Till of the Hun? I can't remember. Okay, yeah, this could be the Hunnic one. So basically this guy uh, makes other people heal very quickly, as well as being a great general. And he moves five instead of two. Awesome. Oh, he can help defend. That's quite cool. I'm not going to complain. That is a random great person, but there we go. Um, I wonder, yeah, adopting all policies and patronage would cause allied city-states to occasionally give me great people. It doesn't specify, but it has to be regular ones, so yeah, there we go. I am the terrible of Siam, blimey. I don't know if I agree with that. I think I'm quite a nice person. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go to Geneva with one submarine, and I'm going to see if that's enough to set it off and make it, um, make it fear me, possibly. Oh dear, Ottomans are being uh, picked on now, and also by, um, also by Songhai, so that's going to be a problem for them actually. Yeah, if Songhai take Bursa, then that's not going to go well for them at all. Oh well, fighters again. Just intercept, intercept, intercept. Thank you. Very kind. We still have 27 oil, actually. That's pretty good. 48 in total. Wow, we could be using far more than we are. It's not too bad at all, really, is it? Not too bad at all. Because election has been rigged. Yeah, they're all rigged. That's wonderful. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Submarines have been done. Wonderful. I'm going to make these guys have targeting instead, I think. Um, just for a bit more defense. Let's just, again, stick one outside Melbourne. Just going to stick one submarine outside every single city-state and see if it makes a difference. Don't know if it will. Might do. You never know. Oh, wow. Hang on. Did you see that? Wow. Bursa just took a huge hit. All the cannons, I would suspect. I could join in with my... Uh, with my rocket artillery if I wanted to. <laughs> I 
feel like I'd be harsh, but it could be fun. I'm just thinking. Oh, welcome to the information era. Here we go. Right. Yeah, our soldiers are now above 300,000. If I start to upgrade my artillery, actually, that would be quite good. Mount Kilimanjaro has been found. I've got the entire map, and wow, you can see, if we zoom out a bit, the sheer extent of the Shejani Empire here. Let's just let the screen load itself up a bit. Wow. Look at that. So here's where they started, and they kind of spread around, took over pretty much the entirety of the Songhai Empire to the right, and then have pushed down and taken Genghis Khan's yeah, taking Genghis Khan's cities all down here. Utrecht as well. There we go. They've done very well. Netherlands only has one city. Oh, there's Rotterdam. That's why. They had two cities. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, and Portugal appear to be doing quite well, actually. They've got, you know, they're, they're very similar output to mine, except from few more cities and a few less population but otherwise they've got a very similar setup to me um fair enough there's nothing we haven't seen in germany's land so yeah we can see my land is very full of army but that's how we like it really isn't it okay wonderful let's press ahead so now we actually know we've got one more spy so malika is the last one and again we are pretty much influential with them anyway so i'm gonna move this guy oh where shall i put him kaisel again culture that one city state is still giving me to this day 39 culture per turn it's awesome it's far better than any wonder that you could ever get yay i'll have an embassy with you <laughs> show Janie, you've been harsh that I know my army's on the weak side. Go away, Germany. Uh, open borders, but now I want 240 for wine, please. Ah, oh, wonderful. Ottomans are, ah, oh, after being my enemies, are now my best friends again. I don't think they're doing very well, the Ottomans, are they? I'd love to play the Ottomans in a really big game. Ah, World Congress. Wonderful. Oh, God, all the information. All the information. Ah, great scientist. That's good. Um... Awesome, so a diplomatic victory is now possible and we are friends with everybody except one city-state. That's good. Let's quickly just vote ourselves in. We need 40 delegates, 40, to win the World Leader Council. Okay, so we're not going to have enough. Just like this. Let's just quickly vote ourselves in. Like such. Um, okay, let's zoom in. Let the computer catch itself back up. Interception, interception, interception. Seems boring that I'm only doing this with planes and not really attacking, but I think attacking Germany at this point would be suicide, to say the least. Where's the great scientist? Ah, over here. Pop him. Any man Wonderful. Destroyers now and land world. ships. Now land ships have the upgrade to the cavalry, I think, aren't they? 260 gold. I think we should upgrade artillery first, though, I think. How much aluminium have we got? Quite a bit. Yeah, let's do that. How much is an upgrade? The 360. Oof. It's going to be expensive, but worth it. Worth every penny. Where's the other artillery? Here we go. One, two, three. Like that. Okay, now let's upgrade cavalry to land ships. Oh, there's another artillery here. Sorry, missed that one. One, two, three. Wow. I think exactly we've upgraded everybody we needed to. Let's just look at the unit list. So we've got any weak guys left. Khan. Genghis Khan. There we go. Being stupid, but it had it in its name. There we go. No, other than that, I think we're good. Let's just stick it back to the research info. Combined arms. Wonderful. Anti-tank gun. It could be quite useful against Germany, but hopefully our other troops will do just as well. Zurich go off you go and um yeah oh we've fallen out the golden age now that's a problem oh well uh submarines again geneva ask for a tribute let's move this guy near and wait here no it's two units i think let's just take a quick look oh no this one 
He is. Yeah, look at that. Military near base. I guess actually Melbourne has my actual military near it as well, doesn't it? So, fair enough. Oh, gunboat diplomacy is working quite well, actually. Everyone's denouncing me. That's fine. But not the Shejani, and that's important. The Shejani who are in charge of pretty much the entire map. They're still my friends. Germany is still advanced in terms of tech, but that's fine. And again, I'm behind both Germany and the Shijeni in most things, but importantly, my gold is still just about there or thereabouts. So I've got enough to keep both this army going and to, to bribe the city-states as needed. Um, okay, right, I think we just need to race through the turns now and just respond as we need to go. Um, sorry, just... There we go. Let's just race through the turns, see if we can get into something. No, we don't want to go to war. No, never go to war. Sam's, actually, they would be good. Surface to our missiles. Yeah, I could get some of those. Frank Bert has a ridiculous amount of defense. Absolutely ridiculous amount. Great writer has been born, good. Just check demographics quickly. Soldiers, look. I mean, every time I go up, Germany just push themselves further a little bit. It's crazy. Um, double targeting. And again, just wait now. Well, Melbourne, please. Artist. Oh, no, writer, sorry. Here we go. Pop him down. The passions evoke. Thank you. Cargo ship. Just keep going to wherever you were going. I don't care. Keep pressing ahead. No, no, no. Uh, nope. No, that's not a good deal. But I could get incense. Yeah, I have a feeling someone wanted incense a long, long time ago. Whether they still want it or not, I'm not sure. No, alas. Oh, no, they did. Wittenberg wanted it. There we go. Zurich. It's fallen out of my grasp. Hang on. Where's Zurich? Geneva. Here's Zurich. No, 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 no. Submarine. If you go to Zurich. Um, same for you, Mr. Submarine. I want you over to Zurich as well. Where is it? There he is. Go and get him back for me. Give a gift. 15. There we go. Okay, we get another policy as well now. Um, let's see which one we want. Um... Plus 50% tourism to civilizations fighting a common enemy. No, we don't need that. 25% um, attack bonus to all military units for the first 50 turns after it's adopted. Again, we don't really need that either. So, um, yeah, we might as well just keep going for... And we need one more level two, I think. One more level two. So let's just go here. Spies steal tech at twice the normal rate. Let's do that. And let's risk one of our spies, this guy. Let's go and put him, so he's, he's our best one. Let's go and move him to Berlin as a spy. See if we can steal techs from Berlin. I very much doubt we'll be able to. But we'll see. He might just get killed. If he gets killed, he gets killed. That's fine. We can live with it. But you don't know until you try. Oh my god, everyone is denouncing me. What am I doing? I just purely dance me on the back of the fact that I'm not friends with their friends. Fair enough. Um, I, would, I understand. I can clearly understand. I don't, really, but there we go. Intercept again. Submarine. Targeting, targeting. Awesome. Off you go to Zurich. No, 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 no. I don't want to go to war with Shojani. That would be a bit of a s slap in the foot, wouldn't it? Shooting my nose. Um, hang on. They've blocked off the way, haven't they? Fair enough. I like the fact that the submarines can go no, underneath no, um, ice. I always find a nice little touch that I quite like. Sorry. Uh, do, 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 do. I think. Oh, look, a new unit. Wonderful. I like the 
the difference in colour between these two is quite cool. I like that one. Um, again, you just wait here. Nothing really for you to do at this precise moment. Um, how much is my unit maintenance costing me? 162. Wow, quite a lot. Quite a lot. Never mind. Um, submarines. Oh my god, fine. I'll transport you myself. Zurich. Ask for tribute. Not yet. No, come on. I need Zurich back under my control. Yeah, thank you. Ask goes into the modern era. My, well, information era, you know? Keep up. Keep up if you can. Satellites in 1933. It's how I roll. It's how I roll. Awesome. Well, I think, to be honest, that's just about me done for this particular episode. So thanks very much for watching. Next time, we will again just continue to build units. Let's just check quickly, see if city-states are actually becoming more afraid of me as I build more. No, no, they're stuck at 65, so maybe I should stop now. Um, keep my gold. Otherwise, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you all in a bit. Bye!